could be seen for miles around North Mississippi today. It has taken much of the day to contain the massive fire at an old plant in Houston. Schools closed early. MEMA is on the site, and area firefighters continue to wrangle with the fire. WCBI Selena Schaefer has been on the scene all day. She joins us now live from Houston. Selena. That's right. This fire behind me has been burning since around 9 a.m. this morning, and it shows no signs of stopping. That's because sitting inside this old textile factory was 2.2 million pounds of polyfoam. Polyfoam is a petroleum product, petroleum based product, so it's just it's going to burn and burn for a while. That's what's putting off all this black smoke. Smoke that could potentially be toxic to residents. So the wind's helping us right now. It's keeping the smoke aloft. The factory is 40,000 square feet, and every inch of it has burned. With the potential of toxic air, Houston Fire Department's Chief Deputy Jonathan Blankenship says other agencies have shown up to assist. We have Department of Environmental Quality on the way. They're going to be doing air monitoring for us, so uh, we should know more after they get here as far as the air goes. In addition, area fire agencies and public works departments are contributing dirt and extinguishing foam to help fight the fire. We're going to be out here as long as it takes. We'll be out here tomorrow. You don't never know. We're just urging the residents to keep their windows and doors closed just to keep the smoke out of their homes. Uh, it's, it's not a major deal, but we just don't want it in their homes. Blankenship says the fire is expected to burn throughout the weekend. The department plans to monitor both the smoke and flames closely. Reporting in Houston, Selena Schaefer, WCBI News.